All right. Today we're going to take a date in the park. This has a very uh, Sierra point-and-click adventure feel to it thus, thus far. For everything from the pixelated graphics to the uh, little midi tone introduction. Uh, a musical introduction. So, I don't know what to expect going into this. I'm going to click on new. We're going to see what happens here. Oh, man, this is definitely like a throwback to Sierra. The Sierra days back in the 90s. These kind of games were king back then. Alright, so, well, this is it. Tapara das necessidades. And I'm probably butchering it, so forgive me ahead of time. I don't even know what he's saying. I can't believe I've already been in Lisbon for a week and already I've met the most beautiful woman in the city. <laughs> oh no. Katharina is her name. I met her in a bar last night and we talked for hours. Oh my gosh, I just met her last night. She was absolutely enchanting. The last thing she said as she hopped into the taxi was, Meet me tomorrow at the Tapara das Necesitas by the duck pond at 12 p.m. Oh, yeah. Okay. And, well, here I am. I'm on time, so hopefully she's in here somewhere or in there somewhere. <laughs> Left click on something to interact with it. Right click to look at it. Huh. Huh. This is very much like the Sierra Sierra games back in the 90s. Move the cursor to the top left of the screen to access your inventory and settings. Once inside the park, you may right click to click on exits to automatically travel to them. Interesting. Probably going to mess this up. Watch me butcher it. Do uh do note that most backgrounds scroll, so be sure to look around. Okay. Interesting. What are my options here? <laughs> Save, load, restart, quick, resume. Eh, resume. You know what? Let's let's see what we got here. Oh, is this a f oh? You got a Polaroid, a handkerchief, a wallet. Okay, let's check out this wallet. Let's just check out. Yo, it's a Polaroid photo that Katarina took of the both of us at the bar last night. He uses Polaroid anymore. Oh my God, he's so blitzed. <laughs> Boy, she's beautiful, all right. <laughs> I got an achievement just for looking at that. <laughs> I wasn't even aware this game had achievements. All right, well. <laughs> Bin. Street lamp. Door. <laughs> Climbing the pole seems rather unnecessary. <laughs> The signs are all in Portuguese, but I assume they are saying something about parking or traffic. Oh, they're in Portuguese. Okay. Lisbon is a great city for walking around in. I don't think I'll even need to buy a car. Are you thinking about staying here? What the heck? You know what? Let's just, uh... It's a rubbish bin. I don't have anything to throw away. Can I leave? <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Let's go in the door. Come on, buddy. It's locked. <laughs> the door is locked, but I don't think I need to go in there. <laughs> De de sure, senor. What? Hello? Obehet de entrada. Justa tres euros. Okay, so I even I don't understand it, but he's saying something about you need to pay to get into the park. Ah, do you speak English? <laughs> no. <laughs> no por entrar, Tim Queen. <laughs> I can't even pronounce all this. I'm going to butcher this throughout the entire freaking video. Tim Queen, comprar. <laughs> oh my gosh. From the tone of the voice, I mean, you can't go in there sort of vibes. I should have a try a chat through the window. Hell yeah, bro. Let's go. Hello? Disculpas this entrar no parque? It's something about wanting entrance and are you sh you wanting to enter? 
Uh, English? <laughs> this poor guy, no! <laughs> For the second freaking time! <laughs> no! I don't know what your problem is, but no! It takes money to enter. Ah, euros. Three euros? Sim, tres euros. I think I need to give him three euros to enter the park. <laughs> Good deducting there. I'm just going to call you Bob. Good deducting, Bob. Let's see if I can find my wallet. Hey, window. Here is the entrance fee. Obrigado. Agora de poder entrar no por por qué? What the? F Thank you. <laughs> Toma un mapa do por qué ten ha. I can't do this for crap. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> he's giving me a map of the park. <laughs> I love how he just stares at the screen. I was like, oh, he's giving me a map of the park. <laughs> Alright. Judging by the quality of this map, I don't think the park authority here has a very big budget. No kidding. Pretty big place though. Seems to be a couple of ponds. So I'm assuming these are walkways. Pond maybe, pond maybe, pond maybe, lake maybe. Alright, let's go! I got my ticket! Ready to rock. Apparently, um, it's all written. Part. I just want to go in the. Par oh, there we go. Yeah, we're in the park. The park stretches off in two directions. I can instantly see why Katrina loves this place so much. It's beautiful, like she is. The sun is shining. The birds are singing, and I've got a date to meet. I've never been what you call lucky in love. No, why are you looking at me, bruh? I left behind a string of failed relationships back in London. I guess I've just never met someone who truly clicked with me. I know it's way too early to say, but I have a feeling that Katarina really does seem different to the others. Okay. You got a lonely white male in Europe meeting a girl for the first time at a bar the night before and he's falling in love. I mean, I'd only just met her and there we were discussing our most private of thoughts with each other. Oh God, here we go. Is it normal to open up so quickly to someone? I just felt so comfortable. I have never discussed the death of my parents last year with anyone until last night. It just seemed natural and she oozed general compa genuine compassion. I deserve a break. That's what she said to me over and over again. With a very reassuring flash of her beautiful smile. I just can't wait to see her again. This is... Uh, creepy. Anyway, focus. Let's find the this duck pond. Oh god, we're going to a duck pond? Is that where we're going? Let's check the fountain out on the way first. The water is cool and refreshing to the touch. <laughs> the fountain is spurting away pleasantly. <laughs> I can't believe the author used spurting. Ah, <laughs> uh, mind out of the gutter, nay. Let's go. <laughs> we'll go left, because we know he ain't right. Oh, yeah. Nature is fine. Let's go. Mm, left to right. Let's go left. I try not to make a habit of lurking around undergrowth. Okay, apparently we can't go that way. So, we're going to go this way. Let's go, Bob. Bob's probably not even his really... Is this a duck pond? This looks like a duck pond. <laughs> As if he's reading for me. <laughs> Is this a duck pond? Oh, yeah. That looks like a duck. But what the hell is that? 
Is that supposed to be like a baby duck? Okay. Mama's trying to tell the baby, get the hell up in this water. You can climb that hill. She's like, no, I can't. I think she even said something about a bench beside the pond. You think? You're not sure? I'm making that up. My memory is hazy. Oh, you're a roofie, poor guy. There's another pond on the map to the north. Maybe I should check that out. Oh, I just clicked on whatever he said. Wow, I don't get to hear it. What's up, duckling? In you go, buddy. Tosses it. <laughs> Off they go. Hopefully that gives me some good karma reuniting mother and child. Oh, this guy. Where am I at? Alright, so... We're in this little section. We're making our way in deeper. Okay, cool. Let's go. Yeah, buddy. I can see the entrance area down that southern path. The northern option goes deeper into the park. What's that supposed to mean, though? Walk, you sandal-footed fool. Let's go north. Let's see what's north. Oh, dang. This don't look like a... You know what? I'm curious as hell, though. Let's go see what the structure is, because I'm curious, George. The statue is old and crumbly. Nothing of interest here. Oh, really? Okay, fine. It's an impressive and rather old-looking statue of a male Roman god. A small plaque at its base seems to suggest his name is Sanctus. Or Sancus. Sancus? Maybe? He was a heroic, though slightly smug, expression. Let's see if I can go upstairs. Oh, I can. Here we go. Is it open? The gate is locked with several massive padlocks. Beyond it is a tiny staircase which spirals down the outer wall of the park. It's probably a 20 meter drop to the bottom. Lisbon is one hilly city. Yes, yes, it is. Alright, so, oh, 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 no, why can't I not stop this fool? <clears throat> oh, damn. Another junction, the sound of the birds chirping away in the trees is very peaceful. Okay, cool. Where are we at? Bro. Alright, so, that's where we just were. We were checking this, this thing out, so we're here. Let's go left. We could go right and just work our way down that way. Left or right, left or right, left or right. Ah, let's go right. This will probably lead back to that manor in some way, shape, or form. There's a building up ahead. Ooh, it's a building. Let's check the statue out. Aw, there's no water. The statue is smooth and cold to the touch and does not exhibit any signs of secret buttons or levers. Oh my gosh. This is where they sacrifice people after dark. Oh, finally some English translation. The statue of the left is Vigilvis, god of healing and goodwill. The statue on the right is Preparius, the god of gardens. There's more information in Portuguese, but that's all I get in English. Okay, cool. I remember Katerina saying she had an interest in classics. She must like these statues. Can I come in here? It's probably locked, too. Locked and bolted. Okay, cool. Let's exit. Let's dip back to the park. Let's go. Come on, Bob. Keep walking, Bob. Oh, hell yeah. Whilst these pigeons do look slightly less manky than the ones back in London, I still have no intention of touching them. Whoa, it's a pigeon, pigeon freeding frenzy. Weird. Probably a dead body. <laughs> Did 
there. Keep looking around. Come on, Bob. Let's go check this uh, spherical opening here. What an impressive domed building. I wonder what it's for. It's probably locked. <laughs> the door is formally locked and bolted. Okay. There's a little sign beside the door. All it says is Casa de Adrestea. I can't even pronounce that. Even with my absolute ignorance of the Portuguese language, I'm pretty sure that means the house of... <laughs> yeah. Alright, so... Exit full. Do we not have the ability to go this way? What, what the heck? Alright, so I went there. I guess we'll have to go here to get to that. Alright, cool. Alright, Pidgeys, what's up, man? Wait a second, hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, man, I can't cancel the action. I'm curious as heck. What's up? You can call your girl, man. Say, hey, where you at, girl? It's dead. I guess you have to insert some coins. I just watched the black phone last night, so I'm having a, a kind of a chuckle at this moment. <laughs> Uh, what was the saying that they said at the end that I, I got a good chuckle out of? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Finney's arm is fucking mint. <laughs> ah, that was good. That's a good movie. If you haven't seen The Black Phone, you need to go watch it. Interesting stuff. Alright, Sculptor back on track. There's no need to climb it. Wouldn't even want to topple it over. Okay, so we can go that way. Awesome. I, I walked all the way around for nothing, fool. Let's go this way. Alright. This is a charming little secluded area. I think I can see water up ahead. I'll come back here with Katrina. It's a romantic spot. Oh, okay. So you're like so far the only person in this freaking place. Let's go. I want to exit for. Oh, oh, what's up? Ah, human life form. Oh, I was beginning to wonder if I was alone in this place. Katarina's not here though, and I can't see any ducks. I guess that meant the other one. That's not my garbage around it. What's up, bro? What are you doing here with a shovel? Is that a shovel even? Hi there. Bom dia, senor. I'm looking for my friend. I'm wondering if you might have seen her. Disculpa now, fuego inglés. <laughs> okay, so he's basically just giving... Look, <laughs> look at that pensive look in his eyes. <laughs> like, I don't speak English, bro. <sighs> I'm afraid my Portuguese is nothing to write home about either. It's like I can only read like little bits and pieces. I have no idea what he's saying. Cuidado, señor. I'm afraid I don't understand, but thank you for your time. All right. Take your seat. <laughs> Facebook will arrive in a couple of days. I ordered one online. <laughs> oh my gosh, this guy! I can't come soon enough. It can't come soon enough, really. I'm just thankful Cat Three speaks perfect English. Oh lord, that's a red flag already. It's strange living in a country where you don't even speak the language. Strange. It just doesn't feel like you are truly there. <laughs> Does this guy have any good? Who knows what sort of hilarious conversations I could have be having right now with this gardener. If only I could pull finger and get to learning. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Fantasy idea. Skinny dipping here with Kadrina. Oh yes. Oh god. This guy, man. Pond, James Pond. All right. I'm assuming we have to go back here. 
Let's go. Or absolutely not. So I'm assuming that she's back at um, the pond. You guys getting a grand tour here. Ah, oh, I'm just sitting here thinking. I was like, what if I had shown him the photo of her? How close am I? I'm right here. You know what? I bet, I bet you I was supposed to show the photo of her to him. And that's where that's supposed to happen. I think that's... Is that the right way? It kind of sucks that I can't actually, like, stop the command. It just happens. I prefer to stay on my feet. Perhaps I should take a look around the park, see if I misunderstood her meeting point. Hmm. Man, I, I swear, I, I, he says he sees something in the bushes, so maybe I should go back and show him the photo. What? Man, I hate that part of this game so far, is I have basically kind of screwed myself. Oh, a donation box, I didn't see that before. All right, so back to what I was saying. Um, I think that I probably should have shown that photo in order to unlock or trigger the next parts. I'd rather keep looking around. I could be. Uh, really keep, yeah, I'm not going to the bench, bruv. I hate that I can't stop. You know, the walking halfway. I have to go there and then I have to walk back. Uh, all right. No, 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 no. I think that's when you commit, though. I think that's where that, that, that stems from. The gardener is gone. He left his bag behind. There was something a bit weird about him. I can't put my finger on it. Oh well, not to worry. I worry too much. Well, no, now you can look at the bag. Same results. Handkerchief, Polaroid wallet okay I'm pretty sure I was supposed to give him the like the freaking Polaroid or something man I want to go back to where that the the pigeons were feeding quote unquote <laughs> Still locked. Still locked. Picnic area. This is what I don't get. Like, dude, there's something off about this section right here. if there's anything else. <laughs> I don't want to sit down. Don't stop me now. Ooh, there we go. Graffiti. It's not my job to scrub off with graffiti. The rambling symbolism of the local team, no doubt.
Window. Window doesn't open. More of a design feature appearing inside. All I see is an empty room with whitewashed walls. I don't think I'm going to find anything interesting in there. Ooh, I don't remember this part. I heard a noise over by the building. I should check it out. <laughs> Hell yeah, let's go. Totally safe. Seem to be anybody here. I've explored the whole park. Have I been stood up? Sigh. Just my luck. No, I can't always be so negative. That's right, Bob. Okay, she'll turn up. I just need to keep looking and be patient. The trams aren't too reliable. Perhaps she's just caught up in traffic. Oh boy, this guy is a loser. Maybe I should just go back to the duck pond. How about no? How about we'll check out this chair? You know, you heard you had uh, all this stuff happening. It's got weird stains on it. No thanks. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hmm. <laughs> it, does it open? Does it open? Darn it! I was hoping the door would open. <laughs> be like the next Blair Witch right there. Okay, so he's saying he has to go back to the duck pond and stuff. Like, what up, bro? Okay. Can I walk over here? Is there, like, fun stuff to check out in the bushes? And Whoa, come on, Bob. Let's go. I was hoping that door would open. <laughs> I was so hoping that door would open. And Bob was never seen again. Heavy, pick up her move, nothing usual about it, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so let's go back to the duck pond. That's the only thing I can think of that might, might have a trigger point to continue this story. The black phone. Finny's arm is fucking mint. Be saying that all throughout this video now. Wait, we're going back to the weird guy. No, we don't go back to the weird guy. We're going to go to the duck pond. That's where it's at, man. That's where the girl, his his future wife is chilling at. Mom, bro. Pretty sure it's over here. All right. Ah, mother and child are back. Still no sign of Katarina, though. Oh, what the f... Oh! What the f... What? What the hell? And it's still alive. Oh, my God. It's still breathing. Maybe I can help it. Yeah, I don't know about that. Oh gosh, there's blood all over the little guy. Yeah, no kidding. Don't want to touch it with my bare hands. Okay, okay. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's go. Ah. I'll wrap him up in this hanky. Come on, little man. What's oh, we just got some glorious ass crack out of that. Oh, and he puts him inside his shirt. No. <laughs> Uh, I'll take him to the vet when I find... I'll take him to the vet when I find Katharina. <laughs> oh my god, this guy's priority levels are just... <laughs> uh, this is turning into a bit of a stinker. I've got blood smudged on my shirt. Yeah, no kidding! You're the one who put it there, numbnut. But I have to help the duckling. I'd feel too bad otherwise. 
always a sucker for cute animals. In fact, I think I'll give him a name. Bob. Bob is a fine name. It's going to be okay, Bob. I'll look after you. Everything is going to be called Bob for me. Uh, you got a friend in need. I just got done doing a video where one of my friends was chasing another one around in Murder 4. <laughs> she had the gun. She didn't know he was a murderer, but she was teasing him. And she was singing, You got a friend in me. <laughs> Hey, I heard footsteps behind me. Maybe it's Katarina. Okay, let's go back. Hello? What's this? Oh, there's a box here. Katarina? Let me see the box. <laughs> now we're having a seven moment. Tell me what's in the box. Come on. <laughs> Katarina's severed head in the box. Become wrath, Bob. It's got my name on top. A gift from Cupid? What else is you playing at? He <laughs> he. Oh god, so. This guy is dense. Hey, F, bro. I wonder what's inside the box. <laughs> Let's find out. <laughs> Show me. Oh, it was a note. It had some sort of a note attached to the bottom. I can't see exactly where it's gone, but I, it seemed to be heading north. Okay, cool. I must say this is a rather this is all rather romantic. This guy is gullible. Bro. Okay, so I said it went north, so somewhere up here. to go right. Let's go left. I think that's where the strange guy was. <clears throat> See if he's picked up his freaking backpack yet. You got a friend in me. Aha! Score. Let's go. Damn it, the balloon is out of reach. There is definitely an envelope attached to it. I need to reach it somehow. As stupid as it sounds, being surrounded by trees and all, I haven't seen any sticks or branches laying around. And I don't really want to start damaging trees. Wouldn't want to get in trouble with the gardener. I'd like to see if I can find something else to help me before I resort to snapping trees to pieces. Interesting. Check the bag again, fool. There's something in here that I can help me get the balloon. Hell yeah. Fingers crossed the gunner doesn't catch me. Ass crack showing you once more. There's nothing much of interest in here, but to be honest, but little packets of seeds. There's a key here. I'll take it. It might be helpful. Ooh, a key. So he's going to take the key from the gardener's backpack that is probably going to unlock some of this other stuff. Uh, you sure you can't reach it? Okay. And I don't want to meet Katarina when I'm soaking wet. Uh. Hey, I wonder if we can go back to the, uh, uh, freaking, that freaking, uh, old house that he heard noises coming from. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> and of course, it's going to be locked. It's still locked, but I have a key. Let's go. The key doesn't fit this lock. Okay, cool. So, that means it's probably the other... Damn, that, that's, that still trips me out. Like, I swear there's a body underneath that. They're probably just eating the, eating and gorging on it. 
You got a friend in me. Alright, let's go to this door. Let's try this door. It's locked and bolted. He doesn't fit the lock at all. Oh, man. The fact that I have duckling in my my freaking... Uh, No, uh, that's not going to be open. That duckling from the, uh, uh... How would I even utilize the duckling? Technically. Let's go over here and see if we can, uh... Use the key. Oh, it opened! <laughs> oh, yeah! Let's go. I wonder what's inside. Let's do a little breaking and entering, shall we? Let's go. Hello. It's just shelves of dusty gardening equipment and lots of manure. Very stinky manure. Hmm. There's two meter long telescope hoe here. That might help me get the balloon. I'll take it. Did he really? Oh, he did take it. <laughs> Way to go, Bob. And Bob Jr. I should have named him Bob Jr. That's how I should have done it. You got a friend in me. The pigeons are gone. Oh! Stone object. Let's go. Let's see what this is. It's a stone head. Looks like a Roman god, a Roman god or something. It appears to be freshly uncovered by the pigeons. The strangest thing about it is there's an A carved on the forehead. Cool. Take it, bro. Put it in your inventory along with your freaking duckling and thing to grab the the note. Is this treasure? Am I rich now? I'll ask Katarina about it when I see her. I recall she said she studied classics. Oh boy. Probably just committed theft. But more important things await. We need to see about this love letter. We can go back to the statues afterwards, bruh. Let's go get that love letter. I bet it's not even for you. It's probably not even from Katharina. It's probably just some random love letter. Or it could be the ultimate. Asking you about your car's extended warranty. All right, let's see here. Boop. Boop. This should be long enough to pull up and pull in the balloon. The fact that you had that hidden in your person is just kind of disturbing. Got it. Dear Lou, I hope you don't mind, but as you said last night that you must you enjoy mysteries so much, I thought we'd play this little game. I hope you like the song. Oh, his name's Lou. I've been calling him Bob this whole time. Sorry, Lou. Well, I do like mysteries. We talked about it last night. She was amused by my subscription to the Fortune Time. Fortune Times? I wonder if that constitutes a normal date in Portugal. <laughs> at, least, at least I know she's in the park. I've got butterflies in my stomach. But before I can see her, it seems like I should have to indulge in these games of hers. Who knows? This could be great fun. Never to be seen again, I swear. Freaking Lou. Now, what does she mean when she says, I hope you like the song? I should take a look around, I guess. Alright, so I have a love note. Hey, I wonder if I can put the key back. The fact that you so ass crack is just... Uh, You got a friend in me. By the way, did he ever collect the statue head? He didn't. Freaking tool. Go back and get the statue head full. I'm sure that belongs on the freaking uh, excavation. Besides, it looks well and truly embedded in the earth. What the? Okay. Song, 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 song. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay, so we don't have a key, we have a song. Where would the song go? Uh, I don't want to par leave the park without even seeing Katarina. Building. Okay. Gonna be okay, Bob. I'm gonna save you. Get him, Lou. Alright, so song. Hmm. Okay, I guess I gotta go that way. My bad. Now see, now he's like, it's some sort of emergency exit gate, which is amusing in that it's secured with a multiple heavy duty padlock. How do you know it's an emergency exit, fool? where the weird guy was. I can hear music playing very softly. Must be related to Katarina's crew. Clue. Ouch. Bob bit me. That stings. The poor little guy must be getting distressed. Not long. Wait, little buddy. Don't worry. You know what? That's how the zombie outbreak happened. I don't know if you've watched Train to Busan, but, you know, a deer bit a guy, blah, 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 blah. <clears throat> it's going through the window, bro. Contraption. Maybe that's what this is. Maybe it's like on the ground or something. Wait, wait. <laughs> Did I just hear a Wilhelm scream somewhere? Probably where the statue head goes, bowl. Uh, I can't reach the box by hand. I'm going to have to think of another way to reach the box. You know what? Why don't you turn on the fucking water? What? There's the sound of some sort of mechanism there.
Build the pool, bringing the music box out with the flow. Cool. I got a music box. It's a small battery operated music box. There's nothing remarkable about it from the outside. I, but I wonder what's inside. Ha ha. Well done on finding this clue, dear Lou. As you can see, I have lost my head for you. Come and meet me at the home of Papirius. Piepius. Ah, I don't even remember that. Bruh. Uh. Oh, Papyrus, oh, Papyrus. Papyrus, I wonder why it's... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's probably that that house that we were looking at. Almost positive, almost positive. We're going to walk over to that other little domed house kind of a thing. There we go. That's probably where it was. Let's go. Bow, bow, bow. Oh. It's an odd building. There's some sort of bust figure across the way. Maybe it used to be a greenhouse or something. Huh. I'm not stretch arms around this way too far. Well, yeah, duh. I could swear this is the house that belongs to that guy. I wonder if the gardener's back. trying to think of like the house of you know what maybe it's that locked double gate it would be kind of stupid but it might be possible there's only two or three places in here that have like a lock system go oh man i wish i could cancel it oh well we'll take the long way then screw it dun, 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 dun. Okay. See, I think that's the, the statue they were talking about. Oh, Sanctus. Okay. Well, it's obviously not this house then, but I'm still going to go up there just to check on it. I could swear this is like his entrance. Plastic and battery operated. I'm not finding this clue, dear Lou. As you can see, I've lost my head for you. Come and meet me at the home of Papyrus. Ah, you know what?
Like the only other house that I know of, mm. pardon my yawn, is this one, or the one in the backyard, but that's the gardener's shed, isn't it? Ba, 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 ba. Yeah. Wait. Maybe this isn't the home of Peppereus. Jew. Good one, my Peppereus. Okay. Okay, cool. Well, we'll go back behind here then. We're going to try the window again. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to we're going to go check out the house again, which is getting really awkward. What's this? Another box on the, st the questionably stained chair. Uh. Let's see what she has in store for me now. Hey, it's the gardener. We have, we have seven all completed. What's in the box? Tell me. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, 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 she killed him. What the hell? I, I, I can't believe this. Oh, uh, oh, uh, I need to get out of here. Uh, the bloody duckling bit me again. <laughs> it's gonna be okay, Bob. I'm gonna save you. You know what? That's what I'm not going near it again. Okay, fine. Be that way. Damn, Bob. Come on, Lou. Let's see if we can make our way towards the entrance. We can do it. We can do it. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I hear a siren. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Hola? <laughs> the phone is off the hook and it seems like someone is on the line. Someone has been here. Hola! Perhaps I can alert this person to the situation. Oh no, I bet they don't speak Portuguese. Hello? There's been a murder at the top of the Necessitas Park. Please contact the police. Um, police estará de dentro de minutos. The police will be there in a minute. Ah, I don't understand. Click. Hello? Come on, Lewborn. Can I escape? Because <laughs> you know these guys are probably going to be gunning for the white English speaking guy. <laughs> you Americans, you all the same. You guns, you kill. Help! There's nowhere around down there. I, I can't jump over. Probably 20 meter drop to the bottom. <laughs> oh, I have a feeling he's going to get fingered for this one. Let's go. Bow, bow, bow. Let's see if there's anything in the duck pond before we leave. No, I need to get back to the entrance. <laughs> okay, fine. We're going to go to the entrance, fool. Oh, what the f... What the f... <laughs> this is a cop. The rest of the gardener. Oh, it's... <coughs> <coughs> How did he manage to do it with the guy in the office there? I'm like eyeball in the corner. Oh, there they go. Guns drawn. Guns drawn. Pare! Ficaron de esta! Now, si me so amaso de ar! I have no idea what you're saying. Pona a manos no ar. I haven't done anything. Can I see? Oh, <laughs> let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. I do it. I do it. <laughs> he thought he was reaching for a gun. S suspect is down. Suspect is down. <laughs> 
You know what? I'm I'm curious. I'm going to keep it at this right now. I just had a thought. Let me see here. Right now, what I'm doing while I have this pause is I'm looking for my Google Translate. Uh, let's see. They got Portuguese in here. Portuguese. I could have been using this the whole time if they have it. <laughs> Portuguese, let's go. I'm trying to get this to zoom in to translate, but it's it's being a douche. I can confirm that the victim is dead. Fly for it. Uh, procreate a witness who made the call send doctor it, the google translates being stupid send reinforcements so basically he's ba uh, judging from the google translate on my phone is he was saying that um, yeah I made contact uh, the person is down suspect is down um, send reinforcements ah <laughs> there's the girl <gasps> oh you vicious girl? You vicious head stabbed him too. And there's the duck. The duck's all like, ah, ha, ha. mama, mama. That duckling's in on it. Damn, stabbed him in the head, bro. The end. <laughs> A date in the park. By cloak and dagger games, you know what? It was it was a fun little romp. There were a couple of times I was like confused and run around, but it, w it was interesting. This is very much a, uh, a Sierra adventure esque uh, game from the '90s. The point and click stuff, a very light version, I'll add though, but still a very cool throwback. Um, this American, he's an idiot. I am American, by the way. <laughs> Just so you're not thinking I'm going at stuff about that. Alright, well, that seems to be the introductory screen. I'm going to uh, go ahead and say peace out, cheers, and uh, if you enjoy the game, hit the like. If you didn't, hit the dislike. Either way, um, yeah, I'm I'm still trying to wrap my head around the fact that this guy, this guy, oh, let's not dwell on it. <laughs> that was a date in the park. Not exactly a date, more like an adventure and a mystery, and she definitely should never have been with him. Obviously, because she killed the cop, too. That's trippy as hell. Plot twist. Give it that. Anyways, letting you go. I'll go for now. Um, see you in the next video. Cheers.